What's up everybody, Natalie here, and today we're gonna to be reviewing Trader Joe's new vegan frozen pizza. This vegan meatless meat eaters pizza. If you're looking for meat, which I'm not, you won't miss it. So let's see if this lives up to the hype. All right, I'm so excited for today because I've been begging Trader Joe's for months on Reddit to get a vegan frozen pizza because as we all know, frozen pizzas are an essential part of any well-balanced diet and I'm sick of having to go to a different grocery store every time I want a frozen pizza. I'm hoping that I can do all of my shopping at Trader Joe's from now on thanks to this. As you can see, there's a lot going on with this pizza. You got the, the vegan pepperoni, and then you have what I'm most excited about, which is this soy rizzo sausage. I love soy rizzo from Trader Joe's. I eat it all the time. I'm hoping that this will bring like a, a nice spice to the pizza and really take it to the next level. And if that's not enough sausage for you, there's also this Italian style sausage. Then of course you have the mozzarella. So this looks awesome and I cannot wait to dig in. All right, Trader Joe's Meatless Meat Eaters Pizza going in. Try some of this chorizo sausage on its own. Mm. Oh yeah, some non-chorizo sausage. I don't know if this piece had a pepperoni. I'm gonna grab one. Oh, pepperoni. More like pepper phony. This is really good. I am actually surprised that I like this so much because I've never been like a huge fan of pizzas with just like a ton of meat on them. I usually tend more toward veggies and things like that, like the roasted vegetable before I went vegan. That was my favorite Trader Joe's pizza. I never really was crazy about the, the ones just loaded with meat, but this is actually really good. I think the best part about it, uh, which I thought would be the best before anyway, just because the soy rizzo is so good that these soy sausage crumbles are really good. They definitely take it to the next level. And I know that you guys are all curious about the cheese. Um, the cheese is really good. I'm not sure. I think it's Daya. I would guess it is, but I'm not sure. But as you know, a lot of vegan cheeses, when you're eating pizza, they kind of stick to the top of, of your mouth. And I was worried that this would do that, but I'm not really having that issue with it. Mm. Yeah, this, this is really good. Try some of the crust. It tastes like crust. Not much else I can say about that. If you're eating frozen pizza, you know what kind of crust you're gonna get. That's pretty much what this is. You know, it's a little cardboardy, nothing super special, um, but I am really impressed with this pizza. I think it's amazing. I think I'm gonna add it to my weekly rotation in Trader Joe's. And if you currently eat the meat-based pizza, I highly encourage you to try this version. It's really good. I think that I could give this to some non-vegans and they would have no idea that it was a vegan pizza. It is that good. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this uh, an 8.5 out of 10. Thank you so much for watching today. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and let me know if you try this out. Let me know what you think of it in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.